Hold on to your butts, everyone. We've made it to round two, and it's not going to be easy. Take a look at some of these matchups. We're going to kick things off with a platformer that's totally bananas, and one with an adorable storybook aesthetic. Today, join Steven, Jacob, and myself, Brandon, as we find out which game moves forward. It's Donkey Kong Country versus Yoshi's Island on this episode of Video Game Fight Club. Two of the best side-scrolling platformers on the entire system of the Super Nintendo that's full of incredible side-scrolling platformers is Donkey Kong Country mm -hmm. versus Yoshi's Island. Let me say, let me just <laughs> you say... You like how I just... That could have been the intro. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so is I'm Yoshi's so used Island. to doing it. I yeah. write these out. That was good. That was actually really good. You're yeah. just practicing. Um, yeah. Yeah. Just practicing. Uh, we'll give this one up. Now, let me say, it I sucks. It sucks because this... Is this, this hurts? Let's just get out the way. Let's, this let's is it. literally like we're on top of a skyscraper. There's two Steves. I have two I have two there, sons. There's yeah. there's two Steves. Uh, two Steves? And I have a gun with one bullet and he's like, I'm the real Steve. I'm the real oh, Steve. Okay, and I gotta got pick one to shoot. Got it, okay. I don't know which one I'm gonna hit, but I'm not gonna miss. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, oh my gosh. I'm glad, <laughs> glad it was <laughs> Oh <God. laughs> You see, I, I carve out my time for my friends uh -huh. to, to help do these series, uh -huh. and all they do is roast me about my big head. Oh, boom, boom, boom. Hey, boom. hey if, if you, I have been on I the mean, roast machine. If, gosh, if only you knew how bad I got it, Jacob. Uh -huh. Dude, if you watch the videos, he it's gets roasted. All the time. Like, this season has been nothing but Jacob roasts. So, Other than that Easter egg in the last video, I don't uh, think you've even been roasted. <laughs> there we go. I don't think we've ever roasted you, Brandon. Uh, I, we gotta find the right fuel. Yeah, yeah. No, we don't have I mean, it. I'm open to the roasting. We gotta get the right charcoal. Uh, visuals. Don visuals. Donkey Kong versus Yoshi. Wow, okay. This is a tough one. This is one where... Oh, oh my gosh. Tough. Good. They both have like, they both have great things super going Super unique. Them. Both of them Very are super, super unique. Oh, yeah, without right. a doubt. Um, I think, I mean, I don't want to be like, well, it just depends on your preference, but like, mm -hmm. there's... It do, though. Do you want the digitized 3D imported models that kind of created this almost action figure looking yeah. aesthetic? Yeah. Or do you want something that is like a crayon drawn with, um, you know, look like a kid's drawing book Yeah. that sells the aesthetic of Yoshi's Island being like... I'm a babysitter, mm -hmm. and I got a little baby on my back. Yeah, and these are little baby levels, but it's not little baby easy. No, it's, no, 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 it's no. Very, not very hard. There's a lot of systems. No, I, I think if I think this is for me, I'll make mine short and sweet. I think this is a split decision down the middle, and I have to say, with the slightest edge, I'm now I'm throwing a little bit. Wait, of... wait, wait, wait. Continue. Uh, I got I got something I need to okay. say. Okay, you maybe you, maybe you can check on mine, but the, I'm throwing a little bit of the littlest slightest bias in there, going back to Kid Jacob Brain, and that is just Donkey Kong. It, it, there was something special about that that FX chip, not the FX chip, the um, the chip, yeah, FX chip. What did the this, this Stanford Brothers use? No, they um, used a different software. Uh, I cannot called? remember. For the, I can't remember. F Argonaut something. Yeah, uh, but it was that technology they had their hands on. They picked Donkey Kong to use it. But Yoshi's Island does use the Super FX chip. It does. But here's the thing about Yoshi's Island I just thought about. We, we, I always remember to bring this up every time we do one of these. It's not just how it looks. It's how it's presented. Yeah. And Yoshi's Island does some things that is unique like whenever you get swallowed by the frog all of a sudden you're in a frog's belly frog and anus. frog anus yeah and mm -hmm. like there's certain areas of that game where you know you're underwater with the submarine and it feels like yeah. that aesthetic changes yeah mm -hmm. whereas with donkey kong country it all looks great and it's consistent all the way through but i feel like yoshi's throwing you a couple curveballs every now and again it is with like the super fx chip the last boss coming in from the the back and rushing you yeah um that's something that's really unique or uh, even environmental things like doors swinging open uh using the fx chip as well yeah. um or how about uh, I mean, I guess this would be more more mechanical, but like some of the boss fights when you're running around the little moon fighting Raphael the Raven, yeah. and it's no longer side scrolling. It's 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 Mario Galaxy before Mario Galaxy. Right. Yeah. Um, certain things like that. Uh, uh, see, I said, and know, also how how the world map is presented to you. I know you, you're just selecting. I kind of I like Donkey Kong a little bit. You're selecting icons, but also the world map. Whenever you beat a boss and he runs and he blows up a thing, and then you see the little yeah, flag pop the, out. The, the, it's the neat. presentation of it. That's cool. But I, I do really enjoy the expressiveness I feel like both both these games have a ton of expressiveness with the character sprites yeah. like Yoshi stepping on something or his, just seeing him like little do his, little, his flutter. little flutter feet there's so much expressiveness yeah. in it 
I didn't but, like. I feel like, like there might be just a little bit more with Donkey Kong. Yeah, I, I was gonna say with the map. Like going back to the we're talking maps. Like when you when you beat up. That was it. That yeah. was it. Da, na, 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 or how about when you lose a bonus game and yeah, you throw your hat on the ground? Oh, Diddy throws his cap on the ground. It's very very expressive. Yeah. Uh, ooh, man. I gotta, I gotta get this. That's why I say it's it's stationary for me. Or stationary, sorry. It's flat for me. Even. I gotta get the slice edge of Donkey Kong. Steve? Tied. It is a tie for me. I'm sorry. I just, I cannot. I can't choose. I really can't. I mean, you both bring up excellent points about the fact that it, that they each do something fantastic in their own way. That's, that's just where I'm stuck at. I mean. Mm. I'll make it tougher. I'm gonna say Yoshi. Yeah? Just by, by a hair. I'm yeah. talking... One of the only hairs I have left on my head. That's yeah. that's how close. How close it is. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and just do for Jacob personally. Move on next category. One's pretty easy for me. And that's audio. I, I gotta go with DKC. Bro. I gotta go with DKC. Bro. I agree. Audio. I agree. Not, I wait. I think not to discount Koji Kondo's work in Yoshi's Island. Mm -hmm. I think it's really really incredible. Mm -hmm. But I think that from Still a got that little bit of Mario flavor from a consistency. Like which if you put both these soundtracks next to each other, which one is consistently better? I think I'm gonna say Donkey Kong Country because yeah. I just feel like because I listen to video game soundtracks mm -hmm. all the time. I listen. To I them. literally I listen queue to up the playlist. I listen from start to finish. I find myself skipping through more in Yoshi than you do in DKC. Correct. I listen to that. I listen to DK, DKC music to this day. It's it's, it's really good. I mean everything. I mean what's what there there's very few well tracks, tracks. Oh, that are more God. iconic than. You know, a lot of than than Jungle Jakes or or even the aquatic levels. Gang, like, gang, do, 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 yeah, do, 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 gang plank, do, 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 bonus room blitz. Gang, gang, pick up that one. <laughs> bonus room blitz. Yeah. Yeah. Funky's Fugue. Mm -hmm. Yep. I even like the, uh, what's dude, the, what's oh, the yeah! Cave Dwellers yeah. concert. Mm -hmm. Uh, Fear what's, Factory. Just the cave music, the ambient cave. Music. Uh, yeah, that's cave Minecart uh, Madness. Life in the Mines. Yeah. Minecart <laughs> Madness. <laughs> gang plank <laughs> Galleon. <laughs> Bad Boss <laughs> Boogie. <laughs> This sells itself. I just feel like there's certain songs in Yoshi that are really good. They're good. But there's some that are like, yeah. I think, I, I agree. Them. DKC. Yeah. DKC. Uh, in sound Alex sound effects, I don't want to talk. It's, yeah, it's what and what. There's some... Sound there's, effects are pretty similar both ways. I mean, if I was judging based solely on the sound effects. I, I mean, look, a lot of people complain about the baby crying. I agree. No, it's, ag it's I think aggravating. It's, a good audio well, it's gotta be aggravating, though. I mean, it makes you want to get that baby back. Exactly. It's, it's, the, it's the sonic underwater kind of like, eh, eh, oh my gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, it's, it's supposed to I, cause I like stress. The, uh, mm -hmm. That's the point. There's certain sound effects in, in Yoshi that I feel like, like the bounce of the, the eggs off the wall, like that. It's. I think almost from a sound effect standpoint, Yoshi's better, but I think I would have to vote the for song just hits oh, yeah. harder. Yeah. Alright, so this is the tough one. Banger after banger after banger. This is the tough one, boys. Mechanics. Good God. Man. I chose Yoshi. I'm, I, I'm with you, Steve. I chose Yoshi because of how unique the mechanics are. Because it's, it's a platformer, but it's a platformer where you basically have a projectile weapon with the egg. Can, can I say something? What's up? We were... When we made this bracket... I remember I wanted to put Donkey Kong Country 2 on here. Yeah, yeah. And we collectively agreed, I, I think I was the only outlier, that we put Donkey Kong Country 1. one. Yeah. I think if Donkey Kong Country 2 was on here, it would be harder for me to say... I, I, get, I get where you're going with this. I, it would be harder for me to say that Donkey Kong... I mean, that Yoshi... Is better than, than yes, Yoshi 2. Because, yeah, like agreed. Steve said... You just have a lot more utility mm -hmm. with the oh with gosh, the character yes. with the with the like Steve said with the projectile, which allows the developers to give you much more unique aspects as far as level design is concerned. It, there's no repetitiveness in that game. They're able to kind of teach you things in the beginning of a world and have you master them by the end mm -hmm. of the world. Yeah. You know, there's some there's some worlds where there's a lot of water stuff going on. You you learn how to skim an egg across the water. So that way you can bounce it off the wall and skim it and kill that boss by the end. Because it's constantly teaching you as you go. Whereas with Donkey Kong, I feel like it's it kind of teaches you everything you really need to know in the beginning. Whereas the sequels kind of are teaching you new things as you go. As you go. Uh, instead of being like, hey, this is just pure platforming goodness. If yeah. you're really good at platforming, you're going to make it. But as long as you know how to blast yourself out of a barrel and how... Uh, Diddy Kong is basically your extra hit. Yeah. Um, that's all you really need to know going in. Right. Uh, and the occasional, the one or two minecart levels, which actually change. Yeah, they do. Um, and 
a couple levels with platforms that might run out of juice that you gotta refill. They got really big on the gimmicks more in the sequels than they did uh, in Donkey Kong Country 1, which means that basically what I'm trying to say is the gameplay throughout the entirety of the game of Donkey Kong Country 2 and 3 is a little bit fresher mm-hmm. than it is Donkey Kong Country 1. Yeah. I, I, I think we're going... Those are all great points, and I really don't need to say anything about Donkey Kong. In, in, in the it's Yoshi hurts, thing... Way. It does. In the, Yo- in, in the Yoshi camp... Man, to me, like... I love when a game... And this is doing this early in video gaming. But I love when a game or a developer will take a a common thread from from video games. Let's say health bars or the inventory screen like in Sons of the Forest, right? Mm -hmm. Um, And they take a unique spin on it. And this game does an amazing job in that Yoshi is... I've said it before. He's indestructible. Aside from falling... He's and indestructible, spikes, and spikes so, lava. so your 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 and health smushed. your health bar is your timer for Mario floating away, and then also which is an amazing concept that I've yet to see. Honestly, I, I in think what's game. really cool is let's talk about replay value. I think it's cooler that Yoshi kind of makes you find the hidden sunflower faces. Yeah, so you can um, ramp that up. And with Donkey Kong Country, you're, the only argument would be is that you're collecting the Kong letters and maybe the bonus levels. Yeah, more, um, more balloons, more... Yeah. But I like the idea of like trying to have a flawless run, not losing any health, Yeah, getting all five sunflowers and getting all the red coins all in one go to master each level. It yeah. gives you a reason to go back and play the levels Play it again, more. replayability, sure. Yeah, and even unlocking a bonus level at the end of the world that you can go back and play consistently. And I gotta give it to Yoshi in this one. Um, yeah. Ooh, and the uh, power-ups, power-ups. Oh yeah, yeah, it's, watermelons. It's, it's watermelon, yeah. yeah. Um, we, 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 we're going to have to talk about Yoshi later, so let's not go on too long. <sighs> narrative. Or possibly. Narrative. I like Yoshi's narrative a tad bit better. Because I feel like Yoshi had more of a... Like, Yoshi's Island had more of a purpose. You had to save Baby Mario. Mm-hmm. Whereas Donkey Kong, you were just getting your bananas back. I say tie. And I say tie for Here's me. why I say tie. But I'm with Steve. Because the, yeah. Yoshi's Island was a unique, a unique spin on a Mario story, mm-hmm. yep. and the fact that you're not playing as Mario, you're, you're not the protecting hero. Him. Yeah. But also, I think Donkey Kong. This is a Donkey Kong rebirth. Because yeah. Before Donkey this, Kong was the villain before. Before this, yeah, Senior, yeah, yeah. He, there really, he didn't really have much of a personality other than being someone that is just a bad guy, just to be a bad guy. You're so not, I, I you're think not the bad guy. I think these are both. I think these are both special. <laughs> yeah. Um, in their own right for revolutionizing their own franchises. Mm-hmm. Uh, so I'm going to say tie. Because tie I, I think me. it's it's not like the, how interesting the story is. It's yeah, how, what it means to their franchises that's more important to me. Yeah. So I think that... Uh, I, I would agree with I'm that. I'm going to say tie. I had, I, I had a tie to begin with. I'm, I'm going to stick, stick with my stick, tie. I'm going to stick that's with fine. All right, so here we go. This is this is another one, man. Stand the test of time. I had tie for this one, but I think I'm going to change it. And I think I'm going to go with Donkey Kong as the winner here. And the reason I say that yeah. is because this, okay? So, it's difficult to compare Yoshi's story to uh, Yoshi's Island because they do play pretty differently, but similarly. Yoshi's story does not hold a candle to Yoshi's Island. And I'm not I'm not saying that it does necessarily, but man, like, if you got that hankering to play a Donkey Kong game, you're probably going to pick up Donkey Kong Country. Yeah, one or two. If you're going to play a Yoshi game... There's, there, there are ample true. opportunities between the two people. I mean, uh, look, look, I'm going to put it to you this way. I'm gonna I don't know. Wait, way. wait, 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 wait. Donkey Kong 64 plays a little differently, so people might go to Donkey Kong 64, but if they want a platformer, like a Donkey Kong platformer, they're probably going to go with Donkey Kong Country. I disagree. I think that Yoshi's Island specifically is the best Yoshi game because oh, every, definitely is. everyone I'm not, after that, I'm not really disagreeing with everyone you. Everyone after that is either no, it's 100. It's, it's, it's not one. designed as yeah. well, or it's too easy, or they went more of a kid friendly way with, with it. But I think if you're a hardcore fan, I think you're gonna go. If you're picking a Yoshi game, you're going to Yoshi's Island. Whereas if you're a hardcore Donkey Kong Country game gamer, I think you're not gonna go straight to Donkey Kong Country One. I don't know. I man. think because there's Donkey Donkey Kong Country Two. Is really, really it's good. good. It's like, good. It is good. It is good. It but, is dang good. But, and I'm not saying this. And DKC3. I'm, I'm not saying even. that it's not, but I'm just saying that, like, to me, like, by the, you know, just, just off the top of my head. Off the top of my head. For your preference. Mm-hmm. Well, just in general. And, and this is my preference, I, but but I feel like, you know, based on what I've seen as far as my research is... My research is, because I've done a lot of research on this as far as, like, each of these individual games, and to me, you know, 
it just almost seemed like it was more likely for Donkey Kong Country to come up as people's preferred Donkey Kong game Agreed. than it was I Yoshi's Island. That. I, I'm, for their Yoshi's game. I'm going to say, I had these as a, as a draw, and I'm going to do another kind of cop-out in that these are a draw with the slightest edge. I was thinking the same thing, to, 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 start, to DKC, just the slightest edge. I know, I, I know we can't draw everything. It's like, and they both win! Yeah. But like, well, I, 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 I'm saying, so if I had to say in black and white, DKC, but I'm saying the slightest slightest edge, just because, like, I again, I, I feel like... I, I'm still in your your quote, Brandon, but I feel like Donkey Kong Country is soul food. And the, this, oh yeah, man, that's the mac and cheese on the plate. Yeah, yep. the, for sure. And the way I look yeah. at standing test of time is going it's, is it's replayability. Old, it's old Country Time root beer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like with Yoshi, there there's a complex system that challenges me, and I love that as an adult. But I have to kind of like get my legs again a little bit going into the game a little bit. Whereas yeah. DKC, I just pick it up. There's some, there's some I think that legs. goes back. I think that goes back to what I was talking about mechanically, mechanically. How, how it's introducing it to you as you go. As you go, right. So you, if you're playing Yoshi's Island after a long time, I feel like you need to start at the beginning. Yeah, uh, no, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't, don't oh, start yeah. in the middle of a fire. Oh, yeah. Because yeah, yeah, whereas with Donkey Kong, I feel like if you start, you can start just about you could, anywhere. anywhere. It's, yeah. just, it's just the difficulty of the platforming gets harder. Um, oof, all right, here's another tough one. What? Oh, By the way, I say draw, so. Uh, draw with a slight edge DKC. Steve says D DKC was what about revolutionary. revolutionary. I'll say Donkey Kong on this one. Yeah. I'll say Donkey Kong Country yeah, on, this one. on this one. I'm but, kind of on edge. I say edge. Donkey Kong Country because when it came out, there was just nothing like it. No, I think, not at all. I think even if it doesn't stand up to... Like, I think, did I, I voted for, for Yoshi's Island, I, uh, I voted visuals, or did I tie it? I think, I can't remember. I think that was one of your ties. Well, anyways, what I'm trying to say is, is that no one had really seen anything done like Donkey Kong Country. Yeah. Just because Yoshi's Island is very unique in yeah. what it does, but... It, it's almost like a Mario World it DNA could, with that's been, that's been amplified. I feel like it wasn't like, wowzer, look, look what they did here. It did mm -hmm. look like basic sprite work with the Mode 7 stuff mm -hmm. at the end of the day, whereas Donkey Kong really just has a very unique... That's what that's its biggest identifier, is its, yeah. its, um, its visual, and I feel like that's what made it re revolutionary. Mm -hmm. They're like, whoa, look what we can do with mm -hmm. these games. They don't have to be pixels, pixels that we draw out by hand. Right. It can be these things and we can load them in. I think that paved the way for... Uh -huh. For for stuff a little bit more than Yoshi Yoshi's Island paved the way, um, other than from a gameplay perspective. Right. So I'm gonna say Donkey Kong Country for revolutionary. So I'm really, I'm really stick, you sticking you sticking by Yoshi? Yeah, I think or? I'm gonna stick with Yoshi. And and the only Explain reason I yourself. Do that is because it, it's such a unique way to do platforming. You know, I mean, it's it like. Is. It's like Yoshi really... gets his own game. It's got different <laughs> that flutter jump, man. Flutter jump. It's got the flutter jump. It's got the egg projectiles. It's got all kinds of different things. Power ups. Um, Water power watermelons. Ups and things like that. And and not saying that Donkey Helicopter Kong isn't mode. revolutionary. I mean, you make a really good argument with that with those graphical. I mean, it just so it looks so good. That's revolutionary in and of itself. But to me, I feel like Yoshi's Island was really a different take on the platforming drop. Donkey Kong genre. Country. No timer. Yeah. No timer. There's no timer. It's true. It's true. No timer. Nothing's pressuring you. You enjoy that game at your own your own Sorry. pace. All right. A lot yep. of games had timers back then. Yep. Best representative of this console. Oh boy, I don't know. I, I, I this is tough. One. I'll say this is almost tougher than a winner for me. The <laughs> I only have one look, which makes no sense. I have nothing to say except for this, and I'm gonna say it, and I'm gonna vote it, and mm -hmm. this is the only thing I have. The only bullet I have in the chamber. Are you ready? Whenever I think of Super Nintendo packaging, I'm pretty sure more time, more times than not, I've seen Donkey Kong Country slapped on the front of a box yep. to sell the thing. Okay, thank you. I was I hoping agree. that's where you were going. I think I'm that's pretty I'm, sure. That's I'm Brandon, do some research. Put it up here nope, if you can no, find it. I'm pretty sure like one of the biggest bundles came with a Donkey Kong Country, yep. like as a Donkey Kong Country package. Mm -hmm. And that's mm -hmm. the only thing I can have to say because I have no other way to compare these two. Okay, games. so let me go, here's, here's some here's some old knowledge for you. I used to subscribe to GamePro back in the NES days. Ah. Bro, my, I threw those away. Not I'm not trying to take time, take up time, but my I threw away all my Game Pros. My first Game Pro I actually bought what? was, Shame on you. was the, the, cover art, the cover art for Star Fox. You need to be a hoarder. For Star Fox! You need to be a hoarder like I know. But, but anyways, what I'm getting at is... Um, Donkey Kong was the proponent to push me towards like, oh, this, this is what I want for. Dude, I got a VHS tape in the mail. 
promoting Donkey Kong Country. Yeah. Remember that VHS? That's an incredible VHS thing. I wish yes. I had And that. there was a sneak peek of Killer say, Instinct in there. I gotta say DKC. Yeah, DKC. DKC. That's yeah, the, I agree DKC. It's the only reason, and I'm not saying that Yoshi's Island is no. not revolutionary. No, because it's, it's Yoshi! Like, I've got a gun to my head right now and I gotta pick. I'm going yeah. Donkey Kong Country, I'm sorry. All right, well, let's just do it. Let's let's rip the band-aid off, rip boys. Rip the band-aids off, boys, because we're coming up on 20 minutes. Where is our winner? Somebody I'm going to say it, Donkey Kong Country. I had Yoshi's Island at first, but, you know, the more I thought about it, you know, putting all these together, the visuals going to Donkey Kong Country, the audio going to Donkey Kong Country, test the time, it's the best representative of the console, you know. I mean, honestly, when you think of the Super Nintendo, it's hard not to think of Donkey Kong Country as one of those games. It is hard not to think of Yoshi's Island in that case. No, I agree. But Donkey Kong Country. You go. You go. Don't let me go. You do it. Yoshi's Island. No. I'm going oh, Yoshi's no. Island. And the reason I'm going there is just because Donkey Son Kong... Gun, you. Just because Donkey <laughs> Kong Country... <laughs> just because Donkey <laughs> Kong Country is more revolutionary and has better music and in, in, in its own way is better than Yoshi's Island in a lot of ways, I cannot deny whether... Don, whether I Just like we were talking before the show... And I, I did the same thing the last time on Yoshi's Island versus Kirby. I did the same thing. Yeah. I cannot deny the greatness uh-huh. that Yoshi Island is, and uh-huh. I think I like Donkey Kong better. I think I would rather play through Donkey Kong Country. I think. I don't know. I'm saying, I'm saying this now. <laughs> I think If you put both these, you say, play one of these to completion right now. Yeah. Which one am I going to finish faster? It's probably Donkey Kong Country. I love that game. It's literally... Quite possibly the first video game I've ever played. I love it. But for the sake of this show, the sake of of why we do this, I have to go with Yoshi's Island. And I don't want to. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm trying to <laughs> I'm trying I don't do it. And I don't I'm want trying to cry right now. I don't want to do it. Dude, we haven't even got to the no, hard one. The last of a dying I'm, breed, John. I'm going Yoshi's Island. And, and it's, look, hey, don't feel bad, bro, because I'm picking Donkey Kong Country. <laughs> Holy moly. I have to. I have to. Oh. I have to throw a little bit of bias in there. Um, mm. It's just... It, I, I don't I, feel bad for my vote now because I'm... I'm, I'm, I'm trying. Feel okay? Yeah. I'm trying my best, man. Yeah. I'm trying my best. This is We're gonna not easy. We're going to get through this, man. We're going to get through it. I'm probably going to start crying on that. That was not an easy pick, but get I, Donkey Kong, I'll do it for you. I'll, hey, I got you, bro. Donkey Kong, I, I'll do it. I'll do, give me the gun. I'll, I'll do, do it. You take that bullet for it. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm tearing up right now. Donkey Kong wins. Hey! In a battle for supremacy, it looks like bananas beats eggs. Donkey Kong Country moves forward as our winner, but will it make it to the finals? Subscribe to find out, and as always, leave us a like and comment below how you feel about these absolutely stellar games. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.